Hump day! All right, man. I know. By the time you're listening to this, it's hump day, or maybe not. It might be another day of the week, but uh, <laughs> yeah. I don't know. When you get to the middle of the week, you're just like, <sighs> you know. Um. Hey, man. Monday hits hard, and we hit hard on the weekends. So. Yeah, so we have a hard weekend, fun-wise, right? I have so much fun. But as you get older, it, it, it takes a toll, man. You can't do the stuff you used to do, you know? You can't, you know, uh, only sleep for 30 minutes and then work 14 hours the next day. You can't do that anymore, you know? <laughs> now, like you eat a piece of pizza and you're out. You're out for a week. Comatose. <laughs> yeah. I know. And when Wednesday comes, it's just like, ah, uh, you're exhausted, you're tired, you're beat up. You know, beat up from the weekend, beat up from Monday, being sucky. And then Tuesday, it's like Monday version two. And then when Wednesday comes, it's, you know, it's... Depend on what industry you're in, but relatively business-wise, it's a little slower, a little bit slower, you know, not not as hectic. Like you're tired from all all the exhaustion and everything you did previous days, but then there's still that little glimmer of hope, you know, that the weekend's coming. Like you're halfway there, you just got two more days. You just got Thursday and Friday. You know, and Thursday is that tricky one because it can be like a, a Monday too for a Thursday. And Friday could be a Monday too. Just everyone want to get their stuff done and party. And especially if you're in any type of service industry, it might be busier than a Monday is. Yeah. And why am I talking about days? Because uh, it's what happens when you have writer's block. Yeah, that's simple.